Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing amazing. If you aren't, you know how I talk about that. I hope later on you guys are amazing. Today I'm going to be doing the updated Q&A since I haven't really spoken. Well, I kind of spoke like maybe like a month ago, but I haven't spoken to you guys in so long and I just wanted to sit down and answer some of you guys' questions. So, without further ado, the Q&A. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. All engine running. Lift off. Now, very first question that I always get, I don't know why. But you guys ask if I have a boyfriend. I do not. I haven't in like, maybe like, I don't know. It's been a while. But no, I do not have anyone. Not yet. Be on the lookout for that. <laughs> Second question, what's your favorite candle scent? I don't have a favorite candle scent but I have a favorite like little little spray that I had in my June favorites and I forgot the name but it's it's amazing and I love it so much it's from Bath and Body Works though I I know that third question is how do you think you'll be when you get married well I don't know what age I will get married, but I would like to get married maybe like when I'm 25, 26, you know, when I get all my life situated and settled down. But yeah, 25 or 26. How many oceans have you swam in? Hmm, that's a really good question. So, I know from my side, that's the Atlantic Ocean. I think that's the only oceans I've swam in. Because it doesn't really say like beaches, it says oceans. So I'm not sure. So I guess one, since it's the Atlantic Ocean. Fourth question, how many countries have you been to? I've only been to one country, which is Colombia. But other than that, I haven't. And I'm going to visit more countries. Like that's... My number one goal in life is just to travel as much as I can. What would you name your son if you had one? I would name him Elohim Moises because Elohim is another name for God and Moises, well, you guys know who that is in the Bible. But in this convention, those names always popped up and it just clicked together in my head. So yeah, Elohim Moises. What was your favorite TV show when you were a child? When I was a child, iCarly was my favorite thing in the world. Like, I could live to watch her. And I always wanted to meet them in person until later on. I was like, okay, never mind. What language besides your native language would you like to be fluent in? I would like to be fluent in French and German. Those two, I want to so bad. And Portuguese, even though it's like really, really similar to Spanish. So I feel like I can learn that a little bit easier than the other two. But yeah, French and German, I really want to learn those. Who's your favorite person in the world? Everybody knows this, I think. God. People say he's not a human being. He might not be a human being, but it's just... He's my, he's my best friend. Can you whistle? Is that good? I don't know. <laughs> what medical conditions do you have? Thank God I don't have anything. I am very, very healthy. And yeah, I don't have any medical conditions. I'm not allergic to anything. I'm perfectly fine and thanks to God. Where do I buy my jeans? So this is a really good question. Um, usually they're either Fashion Nova or they're literally from the thrift store. I have this thrift store called Park Ave in in Atlanta and oh my gosh. It's 
it's amazing i got my levi jeans for only 50 cents and they're like real levi's like i checked it but the levi's for 50 cents and they're all high-waisted and everything they're yeah their store what flavored tea do you enjoy i love the peach one there's like this peach one that i always drink for my you know the time of the month and it's just so delicious and it's like kind of sweet but then it has something i don't know it's just so good how old were you when you found out that santa wasn't real i was probably like 10. i grew up with santa so much until yeah i was 10 years old and i figured it out when i saw the santa at the mall and I saw like the little string in, in the back of his head and I asked my mom what it was. And yeah, she explained it and of course I started crying and yada yada yada. But yeah, 10 years old, my dreams were crushed. How many pairs of shoes do you currently own? I don't own a lot of shoes. I own so much clothes though. But pairs of shoes, I want to say maybe like 30, not even, maybe like 20. I'm not really sure. Is, yeah, I don't have a lot of shoes. I need to start start shopping on some shoes because it's just every time that I go to the mall, I don't know why, but clothing is just my thing. I love clothing. I love clothing. Titanic or the notebook? That's a that's really hard. I don't know. The notebook. Sorry. The notebook. It has to be the notebook. Is anyone in your family in the army? No. No one in my family is in the army, but I do know someone that is, and like I said before, be on the lookout for that. How old were you when you learned how to ride a bike? I was maybe like seven years old. I think that's like really old to like learn how to ride a bike. But yeah, with scratches and bumps in my head, but I made it through and I learned how to do it. And last but not least, it says, what female celebrity do you wish was your sister? Mm, I don't know, that, that's a really hard one. I would like to have Sierra Ramirez as my sister. I think that would be amazing. She's such an inspiration and yeah, I think me and her would get along really well. Okay guys, so this completes my updated q and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't. And until next time, family. Bye.